Hi everyone, it's Adi here. Welcome back to my channel. So, this is part 2 of the video I posted earlier about my favorite books in my shelves. And a sort of bookshelf tour. So, let's start! So, to continue, this little brace section. The first book I collected here was The Diviners. Ito talagang early 2015 yata. I was really looking for this book. And since mahirap nga maghanap ng mga hardcovers at that time, I even posted like a sort of shout out kasi yung mga kapag refersan ko pwedeng mabili because the naked spine of this book um, ganun siya kaganda good thing may nag-refer sa akin which is Chindrich hi Chindrich kaya ako siya naging friend and then the story of this one is a paranormal siya na genre 1920s um, uh, setting niya tapos yung second book niya which is this one, The Layer of Dreams. Um, na off lang ako because bigla siyang nagkaroon ng cover change. Kaya, Give it to me like. I don't know. And um, the third book. I'm still thinking about this. I'm still thinking about this. See, bookish animator, I know. Natapos niya yata to. And medyo na off din siya sa change ng design ng book cover. After I collected nga the diviners, I ayos sa. A Great and Terrible Beauty Gemma Doyle series. I think all lo local sellers itong mga ito. Kasi 2015-2016 sila lang talaga yung merong mga hardcover. So, ito na lang. I don't mind used books. Ayan. Sorry. Ito naman. Paranormal din siya. Uh, India and England yata ang setting na to, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, 1800s naman to. Then I got the other um, library books as well to complete my collection. I love you. To determine what's happening to us, we have to understand our beginnings. The book I've been looking for for over a century. This series, if you're familiar with the Discovery of Witches, which became a TV series, and I think it's at season two already or season three. Um, it came from the book. Eto, sobrang gusto ko tong series na to. So, yung book one ko na kay J. Hi, J. <laughs> pag na. 2016 ko yata siya na nabili. Ito pa ako nun sa book sale. Akala ko naman, madaling ko po pa rin bang... Kasi UK edition. Siyempre, US kasi nakuha kong book one. And then, ito, nakita ko book three. US din kay Maricar Colliada. Hi, Maricar. Um... So, I was thinking, USA edition ko. Siyempre, gusto ko all US edition para pantay-pantay, di ba? Maganda yung even the cover. Kaso, yun ang pagkakamali ko. Yun ang regret ko. Di sana kinuha ko na yung book 2. So, hirap na hirap ako hanapin yung book 2. Book 2. And for the longest time, actually last year or early this year ko lang yata, may nakita ko dito online sa local sellers si Dolly Frank was a Shopee. Hi, Dolly. Next side, puro Harry Potter naman to. Ito naman tatlong to, hindi ko natatanggalin yung balat. Ha, nakabalat siya. I won this years ago. Birthday ko rin. Um, slipcase edition. I cannot believe na slipcase edition talaga na panalun to. Swerte ko talaga sa mga Harry Potter na mga uh, giveaways. So, itong tatlog to na panalunan ko siya. And then, this one also. I've won this one. Look lang, maliit kaya pala siya. Mahilig kasi ako sa pag-magical fantasy genre. I prefer yung mga big doll books. I don't know. Parang mas may dating pag big doll books. And then, these three. Ah, these four. I got this from Stel Hilar. Hi, Stel. Pakalad book siya. Sobrang ganda ng quality na tsaka ang galing kausap ni Stella. Sobrang isa sa mga best uh, seller online. Local sellers. Galing kausap. Tsaka maayos yung mga copies niya. We had before a copy of the yung classic uh, US edition. Kaso twice ako nagpalit, I sold it kasi nga I wanted a nicer copy. Tapos this time around, I wanted the Bloomsbury one. <laughs> 
So, when I'll get that copy. Ang ganda kasi siya, di ba? Ayan, ito siya. So, yan. Yan ang aking aim for the copy ng Harry Potter. Okay, so we'll go to the fourth. One, two, three, fourth. Layer. Fourth line. So, so we'll start by the one. Papunta sa Gmail. Okay, this side, um, pinagsama-sama ko si um, J. Kristoff and Amy Kaufman and Amy Kaufman with Megan Spooner. So this one, this is a retelling of um, Red Riding Hood, which is really nice. I recommend this one kung naghahanap kayo ng retelling. And this one is a sci-fi romance na story, which is nice as well. My daughter loves this series. Natapos niya to. Ako, I think, hanggang book to. And then, this one naman, sci-fi din siya, Lumine. It's ito sa mga pinong nag-launch sila. Isa ito sa pinakamaganda yung unique yung um, dust jacket niya. Na plastic, tapos may parang transparent side. Ito, this one naman, I wanted to collect this series because sabi nila maganda tong series ni J. Christophe, which is, kaya I made sure I have it para pag nag-start na ako. And this one, I got this because I've been hearing good reviews sa mga books ni Ruta Sepetis. And, uh, good thing I found this. I forgot to saan ko nakuha bookstore. And this is really nice. Ano siya? A 50s na story ng isang uh, girl who wants to, yung neighborhood niya kasi super not okay. And then she wanted to, you know, uh, have a new life para sa sarili niya na totally away from this neighborhood. Then, this one, si Holly Black. Years ago, vampires to. Sobrang, ito nung binasa ko. Siyempre, magpapatin ako. Kabadong, kabad. Talagang ramdam na ramdam ko. Nag-feeling ko kaya kabog-kabog yung dibdib ko sa sobrang habang binabasa ko. Tapos, feeling ko mahukuli din ako ng vampire. Ang galing niya. So, kaya after nun, I tried to look for other Holly Black books. Ito naman nakita ko sa, I forgot ko saan ko sa Holy Book Theater or something. Um, Curse Workers, if I'm not mistaken. So, uh, book 2 and 3. So, I'm looking for book 1. So, I'm starting it via e-book in book 1. Pero, parang gusto ko siyang basahin sa real book. So, I stopped. This one, Under the Never Sky by Veronica Rossi. Ito yung sinasabi kong because of this trilogy, ito yung na-realize ko na books sometimes have their own time, the right time to read it. Kasi like this one, I tried reading it siguro parang four times hanggang sa parang feeling ko I need to sell it already dahil talagang nothing's happening. And then the fifth time after I've started again, Sobrang nagustuhan ko siya. As in, minarat ko pa siya. And naging favorite ko pa siya. Sci-fi siya na romance. So, try this one. Veronica Ross. Next is Diana Gabaldon. Of course, who doesn't know Diana Gabaldon? In Outlander, di ba? Um, 2016. Then na. Nasa isa. <laughs> May ingay na mga 2016, sobrang hit na hit si Diana Gabaldon. And then, I was really hoping makakuha nitong um, Collector's Edition, Anniversary Edition, which was really, really nice. So, swerte ko na sa Book Outlet. Thank you, Book Outlet! Ang ganda niya. And since nagustuhan nga namin yung TV series ng Outlander, kaya I decided to collect her books, which is ito nga, yung iba na kay Jay. Jay! Nasa kanya <laughs> Okay, Jay. Then this one naman, I think ibang series to, which ang weird lang, no? Big to, book, tapos big lang yung iba. Small. Okay, next is my, um, Cassandra Clare. <laughs> Cassandra Clare. <laughs> Cassandra Clare books. Ang una kong nabasa, like I've said, is yung Clockwork Angel, Clockwork Prince. Yung the Infernal Device is sobrang favorite ko siya. Siguro ilang beses ko rin siyang nabasa. At binasa. Real book and e-book. Ganon, ganon siya. And, yeah. Clockwork Angel. It's all about Netflix. Yung mga hindi pa kung hindi familiar. Ang year nito is um, Victorian year. 1800, something like that. So, Clockwork Angel. Clockwork Prince. And, 
Pork Princess. Yan. Ang galing ng story kasi nito, um, Angel sh Shapeshifters, lahat na mix-mix na siya. And then, the Mortal Instruments, kunan ko ng book to, if you notice. So, City of Bones, hindi ko... I prefer really the old and classic cover nito kasi mas maganda siya for me. So, kung hindi ko familiar, the City of Glass. Hindi na naman ako sa bagay na kaya po. Focus. City of Angels. Hindi ka pa. Then, City of Lost Souls. Then, City of Heavenly Fire. Ito ang pinakam ko. So, ito, the Mortal Instruments, ang masasabi ko lang dito is, yung book one ito is really slow as in, you need to, to read past halfway para mag-jumpstart, jumpstart talaga, para maramdaman mo na, ito na, ito na ang ganda ng story na to. So, medyo slow lang siya. So, huwag kayong bibitaw. Oh. So, this one of mine, ito yung um, isang series nyo na naglabas si Waterstones ng edition nila na napakaganda. So, yun. So, ito sobra talaga. I made sure mga kuha ko. Sinuwerte ako kasi nung nag-release to, naka-online ako, siya nakakuha ko through Book Depository, which took like... Two months? Akala ko nga nawala na. Ay, even email din. Madali naman sa nang kausap. Yun nga na, ang hirap na. Kasi through post office yung sa amin. Sa iba kasi hindi. Oh, diretso sa bahay. Ito naman, book 3. Wala ko ng book 2. Hindi ko mas tiyempo-tiyempohan. Then, book 3. Ito siya. Ang tagal ko itong hinanap. Sa UK ko pa tatakuha online. So... Gagawin ko na lang ng paraan ng book ko na yung makutupa ko rin siya. Okay, this one, Falling Kingdoms by Morgan Rhodes. Isa to sa mga favorite ko na fantasy uh, books. Yung ito kasi parang there, if this series is too YA for them. Ako naman, ligay ang ligay ako doon sa series nito. <laughs> It's just a write of romance, adventure, suspense, magic, yun. Para for me, et eto na siya. My daughter si Zoe and ako, we love this series. Talagang we made sure na makukalik namin siya. Habang hinawagtay namin for a year na ma-release siya. Yan, Rebel Spring. Gathering Darkness. Frozen Tide. Crystal Storm. Immortal Ray. And ito namang spin-off niya, itong dalawang to. Sobrang nabitin ako, Morgan Rhodes. <laughs> Wala pa. Spin-off naman ito nitong series niya na Falling Kingdoms. This one naman, kung ito is medieval, ito naman, modern times spin-off siya. So, may mga link ng characters from here na nandito na kaya bitin na bitin ako, imagine. Kaya <laughs> bitin ko parang, asa na? Ang tagal na nito ha, yung last tumbok to na to. My goodness, Morgan Rhodes! When? <laughs> My next is the Lumiti. Lumit. Lumati. Ayan na nga. Pasahe! Pasahe. Lumatir Chronicles by Melina Marchetta. A Finican of the Rock. Isa dito sa magandang nabasa ko. Troy of the Exiles and Quintana of Charin. Ang ganda na rin nito. Um, ang story nito, merong isang akala nila na parang nag-ala Romanovs na dead lahat ng royal um, family. It turned out meron hush-hush na may isang buhay na heir of the kingdom. So, ikot-ikot ang story nito. Isahin nyo. Okay, of course, Sarah J. Mark. I know hindi lahat fan ni Sarah J. Mas and it's okay. Iba-iba naman tayo ng taste, diba? So, um, pero may isa ako lala. Like, <laughs> George, super favorite si Sarah J. Mas. If I remember it right, gumawa pa siya ng art for Sarah J. Mas and then, pinadala niya. I'm not sure lang kung masagot pa rin mo ba, George? <laughs> Sana umabot. Yan. So, ito, I've always encountered sa YA group na ano ba ang unang babasahin kanya. So far kasi for me, ang effective is yung Assassin's Blade muna. 
the ano, and the talagang ito. And then, next is the continuation na. Hindi ka na ilalabas isa-isa or gusto nyo pa ba? Pero wala sa biyas. Napaka-bad as ni hindi nang sardopian dito. Ayan. Ito nga, lahat to sa kulibok ko pa to talaga in isang hintay-hintayin bawat isang labas sa kulibok. Grabe, iba-ibang brush. Kaya kilala-kilala na ako nun sa kulibok nung time nagpo-collect ako. <laughs> Ang time na walang mga hardbound sa kulibok ka lang makakakuha. Tsaka nung time na hindi pa ganun super boom na boom ang pagka-fame ni ano, Sarah J. Mas. Nagre-reply pa siya nun sa Twitter, ba, or Instagram. Siya pa yung nagre-reply. Uh, I posted this one because so we um, got this for me during our birthday. Ito lang yung our birthday. And then, pinost ko nga ito and then nag-reply siya and she got it. Hindi ko lang na-screenshot or na-screenshot ko na-delete ko. Oh, no! <laughs> Ganon. Tapos, tower of dawn. And empire of storms. This one's for us from you. The best. Thank you again. She got this for me. Let's see too. Even yung... Wow! Pero gusto gusto ko ito. Ibox ang ganda, no? Kaya kung palit mo, may mga art art. Then this one, Kingdom of Ash. Ito hindi ko pa nababa sa class. Kaya kailangan kong mag... re-read muna. Okay. Next is a corn of thorns and roses. Ito ko sabay din sa ibang release niya. Ito, ito rin. Ang ganda rin ito, Faye naman to. And, um, ang ano lang dito is medyo slow din ang book pa nito, ha? <laughs> Baka more than half bago nyo medyo mag-pick up ng pacing to. Talagang super bato-bato to at first. Hindi <laughs> nyo parang boring dragon ganyan. Pero pag na na, na na daanan nyo naman, nalagpasan nyo yun, super ang bilis na sin talagang flying through the pages na kayo. And ito yung pinaka-ultimate book to sobra. Ang ganda nitong mga ganap dito. Pero this series is not for teens. Actually, I don't know why it was considered YA. Kasi this, especially book to medyo pang adult na yung ibang scenes to na hindi siya pang teen. A few years ago, eh, sa mga bookstores, they even put it sa children's section. I don't know why. I even ask one of the parang personal doon na parang they need to transfer it. And hindi naman lahat brief kung ano yung talagang classification ng books. I even sent an email sa book depository yata and then they told me to just email the publisher kasi they're just basing the classification kung ano yung note ng publisher which is ang sad na. Anyways, ito din. Ako war. Yung isa, ah, oh, ito yung modelo niya. Court of Cross and Sardin. Yung book 4, ito, book 4, Hindi ko pa siya gustong kunin kasi ito na yung kopya ko, di ba? Ang layo ng cover. <laughs> Ayoko na magpalit ng cover kasi happy na ako dito sa ganitong cover. So, yung bago, mm, I don't know why nilabin. I don't know. Siyempre, al alam ko naman at nilabin niya ako. Pero point is, nakaka-disappoint na kasi uy, parang ulit na naman. I don't want to spend money in just changing the... Uh, Cover the dust jacket, okay. diba? Next is, itong Queen of the Turling. Diba, like I've said, hindi ako fan talaga ng mga multiple collections as much as possible. Kasi, syempre, um, budget-wise, parang hindi siya ideal. Especially kung marami ka rin naman gustong bilhin na libro. And then, yung space kung saan mo ilalagay. Pero, like, for this one, isa to sa mga hindi ko ma-resist. <laughs> the Queen of the Turling, ang ganda kasi niya. Sobrang napaka- Ano yun, no? When I look at it, tapos yung end pages niya, ang ganda. See? And may par ribbon-ribbon effect pa siya. And then, akala ko maganda na, diba? May mas gaganda pa pala, kung beauty. Oh, dito mo naman. Oh, ang ganda. The color combination, ang bad as na cover na. So, sobrang gusto ko na siya. Kaya nakita ko yung book to kasi nitong US edition. Hindi ganun ka-convincing. <laughs> Itong book one lang talaga yung parang sobrang hindi ko kaya. Tingnan mo, oh, ang spine. Sobrang yung detail. Eto, tapos yung book. Itong pakita ko ng UK. Ito, book one, diba? Book one. Napasa ko na ito, by the way. <laughs> yung book three na lang pending ko. Book three. Ang ganda. 
Alam niyo ba na nakita ko to online? Talagang parang hindi ako panaginita. Hindi ako siya mako. At sobrang gusto ko siyang ma-collect. Kasi sobrang ganda-ganda ako. Tapos I think at the time na kinokollect ko to, this book 3 was supposed, ano, was about to be released pa lang the year after. So talagang mega hintay-hintay ako. Sobrang so okay. good. This side, ito naman, Sears of Madeline Miller. This was a gift from Raph. Ang gagawin ito, UK edition. And then, ito lang story nito. Ito wala. Yung map. Yung map lang siya. Ang ganda niya. Kung if you're into, um, may details. May kapareho nga itong yung design eh. I forgot kung ink something. Pareho sila nung team. Gusto ko dali ko nito. Ito, um, Gods and Goddesses, mythology. Ang galing din yung story na to. Interesting. Then, next is Gone with the Wind. Super favorite ko tong movie na to. And I was really happy when Dovid gave this to me. Yeah. And then, I found this one sa book sale. Sis K. Scarlet. Talk to daw to. Grabe, ang kapal. No, ano pa mong pinagagawa ng Scarlet? <laughs> ang kapal pa ng story niya. Kaya pa. Kaya na ito, dito ang liit-liit na. Kung ano, nakikita na ba? It's really small. Tapos dun... Diyos ko. O, oh, yan. At least yung mabas ako. Yan. So, yung favorite. Ito ang shadow of what was lost. Isa to sa... Move natin. Isa to sa pinaka... Nagulat ako na series. Um, I've been hearing a lot of good reviews for this one. And nung try ko siyang hanapin, wala na siyang mahanap. <laughs> Kasi nga, kilala na na maganda. So, syempre, ubos na na ng hardcover. Uh, paperback na lang. I tried to ch check online sa used books din. And even yung bago, wala rin. Sobrang OA. I even posted a rant nga na napak parang almost 200 dollars for a used book. Parang hello, hindi ka nang bibili ngayon. Eh. <laughs> Good thing, si Jill. Jill? Jill. Hi, Jill. Thank you again for telling me on the PSN. Ah, si Bookhunt is selling via Shopee, which is at a really good price. Imagine, parang napaka... Yung parang the right amount for a book. Tapos napakaganda ng copy ni Bookhunt. And then, ang bilis pa niyang mag-ship, which is really good. So, I made sure to read, uh, get books to it. Ang galing, ang ganda kasi niyo yun. Ano to, parang lahat na ng characters na hindi, iba hindi ko pa na-encounter sa fantasy book big nang nabasa ko sa kanya. Talagang parang wow! <laughs> ang ganda. Next is syempre Lord of the Rings. Hindi pwedeng may bookshelf ka na walang Lord of the Rings, di ba? <laughs> okay. So ito na po ako, uh, The Hobbit. Sorry nga, eh, pinag-isipan ko na yung nakita ko sa book sale. Dalawang copy siya. Hindi pa ako mas wise. <laughs> Sana kinuha ko pala kapareho. Simulation cover. Ito naman, at the time, ito yung mas parang feel ko. Then I left one. Sabi ko, sana kinuha ko na pareho. <laughs> then, I got this one online. Local seller din. Then, may map siya sa likod. May malaki siyang map. Nakikita niya. Ayan yung map niya. Wala siyang end pages. And this one, binalit pa rin ng plastic. Naswertehan ko rin ito local seller na slip case. I forgot to see Tentay ba? Wait, Tentay ko pa binili to. Surprises out of the boxes. I tried to look for this one. Wala. Out of stock. Wala akong makita nito. Sobrang hirap maghanap ng edition nito. Kaya, kaya nag-iisa lang siya sa akin. Okay. This one, local seller din. Ito yung mga nauna kong mga finds talaga na bihira-bihira. Ito, kasi ako pag may omnibus edition, I tried to get a copy. And nagulit ako may omnibus edition ng Lord of the Rings. And Good thing, hindi pa nabili eh. And, oh, ang ganda ng copy. Sobrang ganda. I started this book kasi hindi pa ako natapos. And, wala na ito. I can't 
can't find this online abroad. Wala. Wala talaga. I don't know kung paano nagkaroon nitong itong ano na to. I even check sa Goodreads kasi sometimes when I want a specific edition, I check Goodreads and then search by ISBN or format or year, ganyan. Doon ako naghahanap. Wala siya. Okay, then leather bound. And this one, Agatha Christie. So, as you guys know, syempre, I'm a fan of Agatha Christie. Tagal ko na kami namataan kay Barnes and Noble. And good thing nag-release sila sa Friday. Mag-block Friday sa ina naman. So, yun. Um, tatlong three stories siya. And one. Ang ganda ka na Super pretty. And the end pages. Grabe, di ba? Sulit na sulit ko. Kaya hintay ko ulit yung Black Friday sale. Give it to me like. Yeah. Then the rest I got from through uh, Vicky. Hi Vicky again. Thank you.